So this is how the transmission works on these solar whirlpool belt drive washers. This is the main drive pulley attaches to this gear and drives this gear here. It moves this, it moves this gear, and this is where the uh, wigwag solenoid uh, attaches to. And this is the agitator gear. And this spring is on top of here. And this is the shifter fork mechanism here. And this is the uh, cam bar. And basically how this works is when the wigwag engages, it, pull, um, it picks up the solenoid and pushes this in. And this um, shifter fork um, goes in. I uh, can't do it. So basically the shifter fork goes in this cam bar like this here. If I can get it to... Uh... Okay, so this is how it works. So basically the uh, wigwag engages and picks up the solar and pushes it this way. And since this dips here, this causes this to drop down, which causes this gear here to drop down. And if I move it like this, it engages like that. But base, but the uh, spring would be putting a uh, pressure on it and would cause it to engage. And that's how it works. And there's a total of one, two, three, four, five, and six, six parts. Seven if you include the spring, but I'm mainly including the overall moving mechanical parts in this thing And it's really not a complicated transmission because It's you know, there's only a total of seven moving parts and this is indeed the original transmission out of the washer and Currently, I'm in the middle of putting it back together and it's not um, Basically, and it's not it's kind of a rebuild but it's more of just cleaning it up and putting it back together and i'm gonna put some fresh uh, 50 weight oil in here and some people suggested to put gear oil in this transmission but i read on the uh, site um automaticwasher.org that gear oil is too thick and will drag on these gears and the type of oil you're supposed to use is 60 50 to 60 weight motor oil and when people refer to gear oil what they're referring to is 60 weight oil and not 80 and 90 weight gear oil because that gear oil is too thick and will drag on these gears and 60 weight oil is what these originally um, came with anyway so that's what I'm going to put in here and hopefully this transmission runs for another good few decades and this is the top part of the transmission this is the upper end part of it and that's why it goes over this so that's pretty much all there is to it